Hello everybody. My name is Carla and I'm going to do a get ready with me. And I am using this Lamora palette, nude eyeshadow palette. It's supposed to be a dupe for um, the I Need a Nude from Natasha Denona. Only there's three pans missing out of this one because this is only a 12. No. Yeah, 12 pan and Natasha Denona's are 12 or 15 pan, I think. I'm not sure. But anyways, I have primed my wow. eyes with this Tarte Shape Tape. I used uh, the last of my Fenty Beauty. It's about out in... Uh, well, it's the Pro Filter Hydrating Longwear Foundation. And I think she might have come up with something similar to this. I'm not certain, but I will find out because I would really like to get it. And yeah, um, okay. So I don't know what I'm gonna do and we'll just have to, I'm just gonna play it by ear and yeah. <laughs> Let's see what I do. I'm not I'm not a professional. Probably never will be. But I just like playing in my makeup. Mm. Yeah. So this is what I'm going to do. Play in my makeup. <laughs> been a little bit since I've cleaned my brushes and I really need to do that because <laughs> they are a mess so okay alrighty I am going to go into this shadow here and it's called toasty and I'm going to put that all over my lid I need a different brush This is the brush I needed. <laughs> I think this is, it's a ColourPop E22. And I think this is a really a good uh, shader brush, actually. Clean this brush off with my color switch here. And then I'm going to go in with this shade here called Coco. I want to put that on the outer corner of my, yeah, right in here. This is pretty pigmented.
and my little Tia's in here whining. <laughs> She's like, I want my mama. It, she, it never fails. She always comes in here whenever I'm doing something, like doing a video. Take that plenty brush that I used to put on the top, and I'm gonna take this and kind of blend it out. I got such crepey hooded eyes. It's crazy, very crazy. <laughs> hmm. Trying to pick another shade. not real sure. <laughs> I'm doing a lot of thinking. <laughs> Alrighty. I think I've got it figured out. I'm going to go into uh this shade here called Glint. And I'm gonna put that right there with my finger. I don't know if that's gonna work. And try the brush. Yeah, I think that brush is working. I don't know, maybe not. this 
And then I think I'm going to go into this shade right here, which is called Aurora. In this inner corner. Everything's falling. <laughs> really need to soften that up a little. Let's see if I can put this toasty over here. See if it'll soften it up some, but it doesn't look like it's going to. It's a little dark, but it's just makeup and it will wash off. this uh, it's a Luxie 245 small shader brush and I'm going to go into that cocoa shade right here and try applying that to the lower lash line Not sure how good that's doing, but take this tape off. And I think find my, <laughs> uh, yeah, here we go, my Benefit Gimme Brow in the number five. I'll do my brows. I forgot to do those. But. need to get some new for sure
And this here is a uh, from Alter Ego. They have some really good brushes. Do an eyeliner. This is not working very good. Let me see. Let me try this Beauty Creations one. I know this is probably a little much right here. This one goes on really good. You like the beauty creations it's good it's very creamy now let's see and I have this uh, Chi Glam bronzer in uh, Golden Sun so This side here is a little darker, so I added some more. I'm going to use this Milani Cheek Kiss and Nude Kiss right here.
and I'm going to use this highlighter by So Rich. And I think I'll use that for my inner corner. Right here. I think my next video, well, it'll probably be a minute because I'm going to do another video after this. Get ready with me. Um, I want to do either pinks or purple. I've got, or I can do a blue. I've got both of the Morello Twin palettes. I've got... Uh, I think this one here is, I don't know, let me open it up and find out. This one here is Brianna with the pinks. And this one here has got to be Brittany right here. And I got them from Beauty Creations. And they're really nice palettes. I've been kind of need to, I'm trying to learn to shop my stash. <laughs> so, yeah. Oh, and I used this Elf Liquid Poreless Putty Primer before I put on my foundation. I forgot to mention that. And, uh, yeah. So now I am going to spray before I do my mascara. This here can is about out. <laughs> It'll be going into my empties box back there. The one that says mom. I'm filling my empties up in. And yeah. Let's see. Try and curl my lashes. Ouch. I, I pinched myself. That's not good. I have such short lashes and I wished I could put on false lashes. Uh, I'd really like to get extensions, but I want them to like be natural. I don't want them, I don't want them short like mine are. <laughs> uh. Okay. 
gonna put on my Grande Mascara Lash Boosting Formula. I get nervous putting on mascara because I poke myself in the eye a lot, which is not good. And it's really bad with this right eye. Oh, there I went. I poked myself. Okay. I need to get something that can separate my lashes. Hmm. It's not. Using this Lash Discovery by Maybelline, and it's got the little fine. Mascara wand. Alrighty, I'm going to put on this Wet n Wild Lippy. Um, it's a rich satin and called Hush Little Beige. Or Little Beige. Don't say little, it says Lil. L I L. And that is the look I created with that palette. I like it. I think it's pretty, but it is a little dark. I need to start doing light, pretty colors like pink, purple, and blue. <laughs> Stuff like that. Anyways, I'm done with this. This is my look, and uh, 
I thank you for watching and I'd appreciate it if you would give it a thumbs up because that really does help with engagement and everything and leave a comment and yeah, I shall see you in my next video. So I shall see you later. Bye.